Just to my uh, left over here is um, a Jewish cemetery. And I missed the turning right at the top here. And I walked all the way down. There was supposed to be another turn in, there wasn't. Or, uh, at least it was, all the turnings were all locked up. So I've got to come all the way to the top. Now the only entrance I saw at the top up here, there seemed to be some kind of gathering of people. And it looked a bit odd. I couldn't work out whether it was like a, a gypsy camp or some like religious cult. They got horses and they all seem to be dressed rather strange. So I think I'm going to have to walk through whatever it is. And uh, who knows, I might get uh, dragged into their cult. I'll find a bit of free love. I have absolutely no idea what this is. It's a, it could be a circus, it could be a theatre group, it could be a religious cult, I have no idea. They are stopping people as they're walking in. Uh, it all looks very odd, but it's the only way to go, so... Oh, they're making a film. Well, the reason why everyone's in their uh, kind of strange dress is because I've just walked onto a film set. So, I don't know what this is going to be, but... So basically, if you see a film or Polish TV, uh, a kind of period drama, and you see a guy walking through with a GoPro and a Sun t shirt, <laughs> but you know, how bizarre is that? So I'm now in the biggest Jewish cemetery in Europe. There are 180,000 people buried here. And I think that's what I want to go and have a look at. Because in that one field, there were about 50,000 people buried who were killed at um, Wood Ghetto. So yeah. Ghetto Wood. I think, to be honest, all of these on this side hit the rough. Yeah. Wood. So these seem to be uh, memorials to people that died in uh, in World War Two. dedicated to the memory of our mother, Rita Krakowska, who survived Wood Ghetto and Auschwitz. In this one family, the mother survived. Her grandmother was murdered um, during resettlement from Wood Ghetto, died in the ghetto hospital, died of typhus in Wood Ghetto, and uh, resettled from Wood Ghetto, selected and murdered at Auschwitz. Fetterman, 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 Fetterman. Entire family. Another one. Dearest parents and brother, inhabitants of Wuj and then lost in the Nazi Holocaust in Treblinka and Lublin. So that person doesn't even know where her family uh, finished up. Looks like they uh, need a bit more funding to be honest. I'm presuming then, but this is the uh, ghetto field.
there's all these uh, graves with no names. Apparently, 40,000 people buried in this uh, in this field. Doesn't look like you can really get through it. Looks like once you get to there, it's uh, it's just completely overgrown. There's nothing at all on the names, on the plaques, sorry. Jeez, I'm just walking on graves here. It's so overgrown. I mean, look at it. Grave, grave, grave. How much we're going to be walking across graves? I don't feel comfortable like that. And there's a fuck ton of wasps as well. So I'm not sure if that was the uh, ghetto field that I've just uh, walked through because I've just got here and then there's this uh, kind of memorial here and then there's a sign over here saying uh, the ghetto field which holds the graves of 43,527 ghetto victims and during the years 1940 to 1944 many were executed and others died from disease or starvation this is a bit run down as well but this I think this is the ghetto field let's go and have a look over here because there seem to be uh, lots of little plaques and things like that Jeez. Yeah, this is definitely the ghetto field. We've got 1943, 41, 41. Um, so literally, 43,000 people who were killed at the Wood Ghetto are resting right here. There are just uh, scattered around. You can see we got, uh, you know, plaques for people. These have just melted away in the sun, um, so you can't see anything, any information about them. These have fared a bit better because I guess they're under the uh, shade of the tree. But there are the the odd stone. I mean, there's quite a big one over here. I don't know if we can get to it. Yep. Okay, so this one we've got uh, Rosalia, uh, Rosalia Pfeffer, um, the wife of Jacob, mother of Mariam and Shimon, erected in her memory by her grandchildren. You can just see the tops of uh, little stones popping up. There's an old one there. This one you can barely read. These are just, I think the sun and the, the elements has uh, got to them and worn them away. You can barely see, uh, walking down the street, you wouldn't know that there's a, a cemetery. Uh, I was walking down the main road and you, you, there's no sign at all uh, that there's a cemetery on the other side uh, as you're walking down. And not only that, but the biggest Jewish cemetery in Europe. 43,000 people who were all killed at the uh, Wuj ghetto. Wuj uh, didn't have any uh, gas chambers and the people who were uh, they either killed through starvation and illness or um, were brutally murdered but people were sent from Wuj to other uh, extermination camps to be to be gassed so I guess with no gas chambers uh, the people uh, 
be buried in mass graves, I guess. Maybe these were all people who were buried in mass graves in the area and they were exhumed and brought to their final resting place here. Well, I don't know who these two people are. But I'm uh, guessing they must have been pretty important. Or pretty rich. To have this as their final resting place. So you can certainly uh, tell the difference between you know, people who didn't have a great deal of money compared to people who had a lot of money. There's loads of the graves in here that have just collapsed under their own weight. Like most of them are uh, just in ruins. They're quite old, but not all of them are. Some of them I've just not seen one from the 70s. I mean, this one looks quite new as well. Yeah, so some of you uh, died in uh, 1980. Yeah, it's a bit of a shame. I think that means that's how old he was 78 y years. Is that that? I've left the Jewish cemetery, I'm right in the uh, residential part of Wood now. We do have these uh, monuments everywhere, so I'm not sure whether uh, maybe part of the old uh, ghetto wall was here. Here's another one here. It doesn't tell you what they're there for. Right. Maybe part of the old ghetto wall. Just at the entrance to the park, there's uh, more of uh, these things. We've got names on there, Kalish, Govitse Vielkie, Pochulice. I think these are all Polish towns. Pauchen. It all goes on forever. Bruchkuf, Treblinka, okay. No, oh, Polish is not great, <clears throat> so excuse my um, pronunciation, but I think that says Odibrano Vam Zitzie Gis Diem Diemi Vam Vam Tilko Pamietz. Which translates as your life has been taken. Today we only give you a memory, according to Google Translate. And this is a, a memorial to the children um, that suffered during the Holocaust. And according to a guy on Google Maps, so it must be true, um, this is actually the site of a, a children's camp. I'm not sure, I've not found any uh, confirmation of that, but it would make sense to have the memorial here. I speak English, yes. You speak English? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's the end of my Jewish history vlogs in Woj. And if you've uh, not already seen it, there's another video about the uh, Woods Ghetto, so uh, go and uh, check that one out. There is much more um, to go and see. There is a trail which takes you all around the area of uh, Bawute, I think it is, and uh, that was pretty like much the centre of the, uh, the ghetto. The ghetto was huge, and of course most of it uh, um, has gone, and now uh, since World War II you've just got these uh, big, ugly, Stalinesque, um, uh, high-rise blocks and uh, I had read online that it's a little bit rough around there so I don't know whether that's true or not but um, yeah just bear that in mind and 
So I've decided not to uh, do the rest of it because it's like a 10 kilometer walk and it's already four in the afternoon. So I'm gonna uh, chill out for the rest of the day, I think. And, um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed that little bit of uh, Jewish history in Wuj. And uh, I'll see you in the next day.